The CEO of Boeing has resigned as the company tries to rebuild a trust following two deadly crashes this year of the MAX 737 aircraft. The reshuffle is seen as part of Boeing's efforts to regain trust from customers. Our Om Ji Young tells us more. Dennis Muhlenberg stepped down from his post as the chief executive officer of Boeing on Monday in the wake of the two fatal crashes of the company's 737 MAX airliner. Nearly 350 people perished in the disasters and the families of the victims accused Boeing of putting profit before safety. Muhlenberg started at Boeing as an intern in 1985 and rose to the company's top seat in 2015. Boeing says David Calhoun, a board member since 2009, will replace Muhlenberg as CEO and president from January 13th. Boeing said it needed a change to restore confidence in the company as it works to repair relationships with all of its stakeholders, including regulators and customers. Air safety is of utmost importance and someone's, you know, got to be ultimately responsible for what's going on with Boeing. So, you know, bring in someone who can fix the problems. Boeing has been in the headlines for all the wrong reasons since the 737 MAX was grounded due to two fatal crashes, the first in Indonesia last October and the second in March this year in Ethiopia. Last October, the 737 MAX crashed into the sea with 189 people on board 13 minutes into the flight after taking off from Jakarta. In March, a Kenya-bound 737 MAX crashed in Ethiopia, killing all 157 people on board. A flaw in the jet's flight control system was implicated in both crashes. Boeing said last week it was going to temporarily halt production of the 737 MAX after the Federal Aviation Administration rejected the jet's return to service before next year. It's the first time in 20 years that the production of Boeing's 737 series has been suspended. Om Ji Young, Arirang News.